Well, hello. Today we're going to take a look at something that was probably my first uh, experience with um, role-playing. Well, it's more of kind of a beginner role-playing game thing. And what we're taking a look at is the game Dragon Strike game. Now, this was a game that came out in the early 90s. These, it's kind of a simplified version of D&D. &D. And um, it's all, of course it's 90s because you have, came with a VHS tape for hyper reality. And it came with a little movie in it that kind of explained how the game was played and you got to watch the characters that you would be playing go through an adventure. They did some around uh, the table stuff where you didn't really, the only, you only saw the uh, GM, I think they call it a dragon master in this game. And then the uh, actors were the characters that are in here. You can see high quality special effects in there. Um, it's a pretty nice box. I haven't kept it in the best of conditions. But yeah, you can see box art in there. Dragon Strike the game. Uh, let's take a look at the bottom here. TS came from TSR. Adventure Vision game series, age 10 to adults, two to six players, in a time of magic and mystery, heroes rise to the challenge. Um, let's take a look at the back and then we'll take a look at what I have left of this game. So this is the back of the game, examples of what it has in it, boards, some of the characters, picture of the VHS tape that you would get with it. And um, for the younger viewers, uh, VHS tape is kind of like a DVD, but you can't really control what you're watching on it. You only have the option to uh, fast forward or rewind and get to the part where you want to see. God, I'm old. Okay, but here we go. Some of the other stuff in here, things that came with the game. Um, it came with plastic figurines. So, uh, not pewter. There. And then, um, here we go. More epic adventure action than you can imagine. Dragon Strike the video comes with Dragon Strike the game. Watch 3.3 minutes of awesome video action as heroes fight wicked monsters and powerful magic. The Dragon Strike video is the first video ever produced in hyper-reality, a breakthrough in movie-making technology. It's basically green screen, that's all it is. But yeah, more clips of the video. When Dragon Strike the video ends, Dragon Strike the game begins. You and your friends race against time in the starting roles of the heroes in 16 exciting adventures. Search for treasure, mystery, mysterious mysteries, and battle vicious monsters. Play as a team to win. You can't go it alone. Or you could choose to play the role of the Dragon Master with hordes of monsters at your command. Are you ready to fight dragons? Start your quest today. Dragon Strike the video comes in. Dragon Strike the game. And then we've got the cost in US and Canadian dollars. So uh, let's take a look at what's inside. So let's take a look at what's in the box. Um, first off, we've got, comes with a dungeon mask on the screen, which I guess for, I guess they'd call it a Dragon Master screen here. Nice little one. Um, I might actually save this one and use this for it. It's not the best material. Um, and on the other side, yep. So they've got the things for the uh, monsters in here. Here. Um, if the, the game comes with a lot of these tabs so then you can slide through. So we've got Bub Bears, Death Knights, the Dragon, different stats and stuff. 
the monsters and the dice that come with them. Fire elemental, gargoyles, a giant, man, scorpion, troll, and the evil wizard. So that's the uh, screen. Pull that out of the way. What was neat is it came with um, two boards. So already printed out. So we've got this castle layout on here, which is pretty neat. I'm going to turn that around so it's facing the right direction so you can see it better. Yep. So the rooms and stuff. And it comes with little pieces that you can then set up on here. here. The neat thing is you can um, flip it over and on the other side is a cave. And then um, we'll take a look at the uh, next one. One. Okay. And... Oh, one second. Okay. And the next one is field set up you know, and a neat aspect to this thing you'll see these, um, these counters on the side of the thing and at the bottom of it is a dragon um, from what I remember playing this each game had a or each of the quest had a time limit to it, and if you didn't complete them by the time limit, the dragon appeared and would just make the game even more complicated. Let's uh, flip this over. Okay, and the next one is a town setup. Oh, that's a warrior card. There we go. Yep, so a nice little grid. And for some reason, an elemental, water elemental in the fountain. It's still pretty neat. Um, and we'll take a look at the pieces and the other stuff that came with the game. So yeah, it's kind of a mess, but here's all the stuff that came with it. Um, these were your uh, character sheets. There's the warrior. And um, there was the actor who played the warrior in the uh, video that came with it. Oh, for some reason, I've still got a grade school assignment notebook in here. here. Um, yeah, I'm not going to go into that. Before you had computers to take notes on, you took notes in notebooks. Okay, let me clear that out of the way. But yeah, so there's the thing. Um, rule book. This has got the um, adventures on there. Oh, and then it came with the this book of maps that then related to the things. So you knew, if you were the DM, where the monsters would be, where the treasures and the traps, and if you were setting up extra doors in the thing. Um, yep, yeah, so the adventure book has, has several adventures in it. I think event, I feel kind of bad, but we made my mom DM this for us for a long time. I do not think she enjoyed it. But she would do it. Um, and actually, the first time we tried to play this, it didn't work out. So we called up my cousin, who um, was actually, who played D&D. Uh, we went over to his house. It was, it was, it took a long time because he had to read through the rule book and the adventure. But yeah, he ran us through our first game in this. So that was really fun. Uh, thank you, Jason, for uh, doing that. Me when I was a kid. Um, oh, here we go. Came with uh, trap cards to do the random stuff. So a rusty trap. Um, hero spells. So levitate. They had the rules in there. And as you can see, the figures are kind of these standard old figures. They're just molded in plastic. Steak instead of pewter. Uh, ooh. Then uh, that's your dragon. So, uh, yeah, this is the game. It's 
kind of a neat little setup here. It's pretty messy. And I know I don't have the dice in here anymore because um, all the dice for this game went to um, my first D&D &D set. Because instead of buying dice, I realized that this game used the same set of dice. So uh, we're using that. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. Um, I found this in here as well. Uh, McDonald's uh, Happy Meal Transformer. I am going to have to send that over to a friend of mine. And, but, yeah. So, uh, yeah, that says this is the Dragon Strike game. Oh, and also has some monster character stuff in here. Uh, let me line up some stuff so we can get a better view of it. Kind of want to go through the characters. So I got so I got the character stuff set up here. Here, um, classic uh, D and D characters for the early thing. We've got a warrior instead of a fighter barbarian. In um, and obviously the images on here are from the hyper reality video thing they were talking about earlier in the thing. Um, character stats, not really stats, but just kind of stuff. I don't think we ever use the equipment in this game. Yeah. Um, you've got, of course, the wizard. So same thing. <laughs> and then um, instead of other races, you you had elf as a class and you have dwarf as a class so let me go over both of those that's elf okay now um i don't know and then you've got dwarf here and then um below the dwarf we've got the thief of course this is the only uh female character this being an early 90s game though you don't just have this thief, you also have a male thief as well, you know, because boys aren't going to want to play a female character. Early 90s, what am I going to tell you? But, yeah, same stats. That's for them. I did not keep these in very good conditions. Okay, um... Thank you for uh, checking this out. So that was Dragon Strike, the game. Our Dragon Strike game, as it's referred to itself. Oh, uh, thank you for uh, letting me uh, reminisce about a uh, early uh, role-playing game I used to play. It's been a lot of fun. Hope you enjoyed it. And um, have a nice day. Oh, and as always... Don't you dare like or subscribe to my channel. Bye.